if you don't like what Redbubble is doing, nod your head. In this video, we're going to be talking about, in my opinion, what we really should be doing as artists with Redbubble, and that is boycotting the living crap out of them. Because Redbubble has crossed the line this time more than I've ever seen them cross the line before. And, and believe me, that's really telling because they have crossed the line quite a few times. Um, what they have done, if you don't know, and I'm sure, I'm sure if you've seen my past videos, if you've, you're a current subscriber, you know that their fees that they have just introduced, these earnings bracket and then compared to a fee is completely ridiculous. Basically, if you make $2 on this, you know, print on demand site, all your designs, all of your hard work that you put in there, just based on a commission, not in not how much the item makes for Redbubble themselves, not none of that. Just the commission that they give you as an artist, that person that runs Redbubble. Keep all that in mind. If you make $2, you make one buck every two dollars that you make on Redbubble. Now, don't get me wrong, it goes down a little bit, you know, like uh, six dollars, and there's a fee of 270. Whoa, that's what a change that is, right? If let's just say you make twenty dollars, uh, you make nine dollars twenty cents every single, um, you know, there every single time there is an account fee. So here, right here, it says where to find a record of your account fees. If you are subject to an account fee, this will be reflected in your monthly seller earnings email. It can also find a record of any account fees deducted from your monthly earnings and previous pay cycles on the account tiers and fees page. In my opinion, I don't think that anyone really should continue selling on this particular website. There are other ways to sell. I'm going to give you a few right now. Number one is Printful. Number uh, two is, is what do you call it? Is, uh, is selling on Etsy and eBay. And I'll give you another one too, which is not the best one because this one, they've done pretty well. They've done pretty poorly also to their consumer too, but amazingly enough, not as bad as Redbubble. And that is uh, Amazon. I'm someone who kind of, you know, boycotted Amazon a little bit because I think that they have gotten a little bit too big in terms. Of, I don't think I know they've gotten a little a little too big, um, which of course is an understatement. So I've kind of held back in terms of selling certain products on Amazon. Like the merch, for instance, the merch by Amazon, what I did was I sold on Redbubble or Etsy or let's just say Etsy, of course, when they were much smaller, too. They've gotten huge, um, you know, eBay and all that other good stuff. Um, Teespring, that was another one. And also Public, which now Redbubble owns, by the way. Public, I was selling on there. Uh, still sell on there, and they were, you know, this is way before um, Redbubble even bought them out. But, yeah, I mean, it's unbelievable how, how time has just gone on. But what I would say is I would definitely, uh, definitely protest and boycott Redbubble for sure because uh, these fees have gotten just so insane that you are now subject to pay Redbubble and they're not even giving you these fees in terms of a tax deduction or anything like that. They're just they're just freaking wheeling and dealing on this one, man. Wow. But I don't know. That's what I think. I really do think that there should be some sort of boycott because if there is a boycott, then what could happen is um they could just get rid of these ridiculous fees and stop punishing people that actually make the website what it is, who are, of course, the artists. That's really the only people that are making this website what it is, are the artists. And, um, I mean, I don't know, that's just my opinion. And, uh, I'm sticking to that one. 
What do you guys think? Remember to leave it in the comments. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. Do you think that we should boycott uh, Redbubble? Let me know. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.